friends, the TV's Naughtiest Blunders 4, the show which takes a risk with the risque, a wry look at the ribald, and guarantees a roar with the raucous. <laughs> but first, and as rightly befits a sophisticated production like this, here's an important announcement from Yorkshire TV's highly respected weatherman, Mr Bob Rust. Over to you, Bob. Ah, oh, bloody hell. Well, you don't blame me for all these bloody outtakes. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Yes, yes. You realise you've got dog <laughs> on your shoe. <laughs> <laughs> Only on the back. You can't really see it, though. Well, you think this is chaos? Wait till you spend two weeks living with an eight-year-old boy. <laughs> now he's eleven. <laughs> <laughs> Just for your information, that is about as erotic as being rubbed down with a raw chicken. <laughs> You know, I don't know what to say now. <laughs> huh? What's wrong with you? Just settle into it. Please. We'll have to go back. I lost Miss Stiffy. It's <laughs> <laughs> all right. Have <laughs> this time. Hello, Trops. What's the point? <laughs> oh, yeah. Two lollipop sticks and Mr. Clues, please. Oh, dead. <laughs> <laughs> you know, after that frosty start this morning, it turned out to be quite a fine day across the region with temperatures up to 13 centigrade, which is 55 Fahrenheit. There was some cloud around, though, and it has been increasing this afternoon, and this shows up quite well on the satellite picture. We should squeeze a dry day out of it today. Tomorrow. Everyone seems to prefer peers to me, especially the women, and I don't know why. Did you see how he dealt with that flood the other day? Yeah, he entered the water doing a double pike with twist, rescued everybody in sight and then sang a medley of Andrew Lloyd Webber songs. <laughs> Great, huh? No, he's uh, just a big... There. ...show off. <laughs> Good evening. And welcome to another edition of Bullseye. I'd like to say to the director, stick the show up your ass. I'm sick to death of it. Thank you. Uh, I've said it time and time again, uh, we've got a group of the finest police officers anywhere in the world. And uh, again, they proved themselves tonight. No one was injured, and, uh, and the uh, hostage situation came to How a were successful conclusion. Give us a clue about negotiations. Oh, well, hey. 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 Do you better get the fuck out. You're going back to the bill, and where's where's the bill? You were, um, in Merton. In Merton. You're going back to the, uh, Merton with. Yep. Um, I'll do all that again because that was. Oh god. <laughs> Alright, we're pumping it up and down. Waking the nation up, that's what it's all about. Here we go, left hand up. Go up. Now give me right hand. Take the left hand down. Yeah. Ow. Okay. <laughs> I saved her honestly, man. Okay, don't worry, we're pumping up and down. What's... Hey? Action, <laughs> rat. <laughs> What's your name? Um, Norman. <laughs> Norman who? Uh, Norman Wisdom. I don't know. <laughs> what are you doing in Deadwood, stranger? <laughs> I'm having a <laughs> Forever leg pulling Freddy Star there with his own version of a fistful of dollars. <laughs> Sadly, now we come to the final selection of the cheekiest clips we could find on the cutting room floor. They're all from the world of televised sport, which on this show has always provided a rich source of pure and simple, honest to goodness verbal naughtiness. At least with these sporting types, you know where you stand, and that's as far away as possible. <laughs> Auto. Floor. Well, I'm not stopping down what? there. Where's the bloody stop flag then? Does he know what he's doing? Oh, that should be shot. <laughs> Have you got everything? Yeah. Then what about this? Lord? Just cut it out. Just calm down, will you? Well, what am I supposed to do? 
us through. A red flag means stop there, doesn't it? So what, what do I do? Stop and lose all the time? All I want to know is what's going on. I'm just as excited as everybody else. <laughs> One dog still in hot pursuit, yes. uh, and all the other dogs are sort of in the group left behind. Yes, I'm afraid they're playing over there, and, and it looks as if. <laughs> Philistine, but what is the point of this sport? Can you explain it? Uh, Helen, just to go fast. <laughs> Nothing else. Get there without falling off. Uh, I mean, uh, what else would you do on your back? Uh, <laughs> a few other things, but perhaps we shouldn't talk about them. What else have you got for us, Ken? Here wurde heute alles ein bisschen durchgelüftet. Und wir schauen, in Mannheim sich eine Lösung da in den Landes. And so, to sum it up, we were uh, on the wing, we were oh. on the other wing, we were can you, can, you sum up? Were can you sum up how we were without swearing? Absolutely, Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> that was a tough one, I'll tell you. I don't think I'll have a much tougher loss than that in overtime, seventh game, going in the finals, boys. What more can happen? What more can happen? I'm telling you. How about a prediction on the final? It's like asking me what I want, sif or gonorrhea. <laughs> <laughs> When's it going to end? I know how Williams feels now. I guess a fellow like Rick Middleton really wanted to play badly against the Rangers. Yeah, well... <laughs> well, if you'd have won, you'd have been playing the Rangers. Yeah, if my aunt had nuts, she'd be my uncle. <laughs> tonight my dear friends uh, thanks to all the stars for letting us see their naughty bits let's do it again real soon i'm steve pink good night everyone <laughs> <laughs>